All right, guys. So today's everyone's favorite day, chest day. And I just want to say it's been a minute since I've recorded because my lens has broke. Not has my lens has broke. Broke. My lens has broke. My lens got broken because my sister probably moved it and then the camera tilt, like tilted over with the little uh, tripod stuff and it hit the wall. I don't know what happened, but it kind of bent the, uh, the lens, like it made it a little slanted. And every time I tried twisting it, it wouldn't work and the autofocus would not work. So yeah, I had to buy a new one. And I also got some new lenses with it and some cover for it, like you can hear it right here. And it protects it from falling and stuff like that. So, yeah. But everything has been well. You know, life, not so well. But, you know, stuff happens. Life, you keep on going, keep on pushing. And yeah, you just live and you learn. Take lessons from all your bad times, I guess. I don't know. I'm not really good at driving and talking and stuff. So this is a, this is actually a first. I'm actually gonna you know talk for a little bit into the camera until we you know we get to the gym and do our chest day. You know some some Sam Sully type shit. I have chest day. But. Yeah, to be honest, I actually kind of want to start doing videos like this. Like, you know, let's say just drive to the gym, you know, talk, or, you know, if I go home, eat, talk to the camera. I actually like these type of simple videos because I don't really have to, you know, think on the angles, the the shots, and how I'm going to do them, the, the song I'm going to use, or anything. It's just you talk to the camera, go to the gym, lift heavy, have a great pump, have an amazing pump. Know, just talk to the camera and yeah you know go check your pump pump check that's it go home eat chilling and you know if I want if I, got, if I want to tell you something about me or let's say like, you know what what I'm eating for bulking or you know tips and stuff like that I can tell you but I'm not a good person for tips because I'm not a big ass person but yeah I mean what time I'll probably get more bigger get more experienced and you know tell you my faults tell you my cons and yeah but one of my faults right now is uh i guess i'm getting way too big i don't know if it's my genetics or is it because i'm doing it wrong but i feel like it's my part of my genetics because um i'm very big right now like i'm not big big like you know big as in muscle wise big but i have gained some pretty good amount of muscle but it's just that I gained so much of my body fat into my uh, midsection, which makes my stomach very, very bloated and big, which I do not like. It's very bad. And when I wear my shirts, I, I don't fit into my shirts anymore. Like I used to wear large and it used to, you know, fit me like a, a pump cover, you know, like big, loose everywhere and stuff. But now it's just all tight. I feel like, like, like suffocating in it. I feel like I'm claustrophobic in that damn shirt. And when I'm like going out, you can see my belly. And it's not a good thing, man. I was just recording, um, no, no, my friend was recording uh, Leg Day with me on his channel. Go check it out, I think it's called Gil. I'll leave it on the screen, so go check it out. And, bro, I'm doing leg extensions, and you can see my belly. And I'm like, oh my God, man. And I was wearing a compressed uh, tee. Well, not really compressed, but you know, it's like a little loose, soft, but it's a little bit compressed. And bro, you can see my belly. And I'm like, yeah, no. But, you know, the bulk is the bulk, man. You gotta look bad. So when you cut, you look like a majestic beast. <laughs> but yeah. What else was I gonna say? Uh, let's see, let's see, think about, think about. I was gonna say something, but, oh, I am currently right now, early in the morning, peed, no clothes on and everything, 186. I'm 186 pounds, which I actually do like. 
damn Honda Civic drivers but I do like the fact that I'm 186 and I am stronger than I was before in my other bulk which I really really do like that means I've been actually you know building muscle getting straight uh, gaining strength and you know overall it's, it's going everything is going well and right now I think I'm a bit a bit heavy because I did eat a lot yesterday I ate a lot I, I, I ate a quite a bit yesterday so I'm pretty heavy it's probably just water weight and stuff and I've been taking creatine which I think it's working I'm getting my few extra reps on my lifts and yeah I've been getting stronger too so I think it is the creatine and it's helping me build muscle I guess and yeah and I'm a little bit sick if I sound you know a little bit weird from the from my voice and stuff it's a little like weird deep and stuff not like some nasal shit but uh, yeah um yeah I guess that's it for the car talk um I'll just see y'all in the gym so yeah I just did three warm-ups. I did the bar, 25 and a 35, but now it's the working set. We're gonna do four sets of incline. I do hate about barbell fucking bench is that it, hurt, it hurts my palms but I feel like I just gotta get used to it so This is gonna be my last set, fourth set, and then after that we're gonna go on some cable flies. We're gonna go from high to low, and then from there we're gonna go do some peg decks. So this is the last set. Drop set. Alright, we're gonna go from high to low first. I have this really bad habit of not bringing a water bottle or a water jug with me and I always have to go drink water because I'm thirsty as shit. Look at that. A little print already. Two sets on each. So two sets high, two sets middle, and then two sets low. Oh, well, up. I don't know.
don't go heavy on them because I like to feel the contraction instead of going heavy and shit not feeling it. So what I usually do is go heavy on my compound set, which is the bench. And then for my accessories, I just like to feel the burn and feel a good contraction on the chest. But always remember to go to Philly. Good tip I could give you guys is um when you guys are doing cables, try not to drag your arm fully out because it put more emphasis on the shoulder, on your front delt. And at one point, I did that a lot, and my front delt just completely got fucked. And I couldn't do anything. I couldn't do lateral raises, shoulder press, and even bench. So, you know, just keep it at a safe distance and push from there. You want to feel from the chest, not from your shoulders. go light remember same I just want to feel the contraction Three more sets of these and we're done because I was supposed to do biceps for chest so because my split is chest and biceps but I already did biceps uh, yesterday no not yesterday before yesterday was back so today's just chest so yeah three more sets of these and we're done Check the shitty pump.
Guys, that was chest day. It was pretty good. Felt a little pumped on my chest, but when I look at it in the mirror, it looks like absolute shit. Or I don't know, maybe I have body dysfunction. But I will talk to you guys more when I get home because I'm currently holding the tripod right now. I don't have a camera set up for the car, so when I'm driving, I'm literally holding on to the, the tripod with the camera while I'm driving and talking to you guys at the same time. So, I'll talk to you guys when I get home. Back home. Until the lighting goes up a little bit. There we go. I'm back home. Now we're going to have my favorite drink. It's um, lemon iced tea powder with some cream to it. Which I have to go get a cup. Wait a minute, it's in my room. I had some in the morning with some spaghetti. That's what I usually eat it with. Wait a minute, hopefully I don't, I don't drop all of this. Because if I do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be very sad. Ah, right, there we go, we got it. All right, there we go. I have this with some spaghetti. I'm just gonna make it up, put it in the freezer, and then make some spaghetti and eat it. And yeah, that's pretty much basically it. And then the rest of the day, I guess nothing. It's raining, so what is there for me to do? Um, I think I could just make a reel or something or a funny video on TikTok or some shit, but yeah. But I guess I'm just gonna end the video here. If you guys like these type of videos, um, leave them in the comments. You guys don't leave them in the comments. You guys don't even comment on my videos. So to be honest, I'm just gonna stop saying that because there's no point to. And uh, yeah. Peace.